is you're going to wash your hands. The next thing you're going to do is you're going to set up. Needle with safety. Tube holder without safety. Tube. An extra tube just in case. Alcohol wipes. Gauze. And Coban. Then you're going to put the tourniquet on without gloves. And palpate for the vein. Then you're going to put your gloves on. Oh, sorry. Make sure that everything is accessible to you. Remove the clear plastic portion of the needle where you will see the rubber sleeve over the needle. You can go ahead and assemble it now, it's fine. And then just put your safety back. Go ahead and clean the site, which I did it backwards, in a circular motion. Inner to outer. Allow the site to dry. To, if you need to make a mark, you can use the um, clear plastic side of the other side of the needle and just go into a circular motion of where you're going to go. The indentation hurts a little bit, so make sure to check on your patient. How are you doing? Good. So that's good, and you can see the indentation of where you're going. Yes. And then reapply the tourniquet. Nice and tight so we can see the vein as prominent as possible. Can you clench your fist for me, please? Perfect, thank you. Removing the needle cap away from you and away from the patient, making sure that your bevel is up. Anchoring with your thumb, never too close, far enough, and inserting and gliding the needle easily. Now if a little blood comes out like that, just grab some gauze and easily dab it so you can see your sight. Go ahead and insert the tube using your flanges. So you can do the peace sign up here and just uh, your thumb at the bottom and insert. Look at your tube. You can release your fist. Release tourniquet, making sure your eye is always on the needle. Then releasing your tube using the two fingers at the bottom and your thumb on the flanges to get it out. Go ahead and invertently mix. Grab your gauze. Can you please apply pressure? Mm -hmm. And safety immediately on the needle and straight into sharps. Therefore, check your sight. Make sure that it is stopped bleeding. Apply pressure if needed to, depending on how much blood you have. You can change the gauze, fold it into fours, and remove it. You can apply pressure, please. And you can grab your Coban. Are you allergic to any mm -mm. tape? Okay. And we can go ahead and apply the Coban. Nice and tight, but not too tight, so they can still move their arm. And you can go around as many times as you'd like, but that's good enough. Twice around is perfect. And how are you feeling? Perfect. Awesome. Thank you. You're all done. Thank you. Thank Great you. Job.